Alrighty, where am I gonna plant this celery? I need a good spot where it'll take root. Uh, oh, oh, Dean, I didn't see you there. Um, okay, well, my name is Melissa. I am the president of the Rotary of Elizabeth Key, and I'm here uh, to tell you a bit about our upcoming events and what we have in store for the Rotary of Elizabeth Key Club this year. Well, first of all, uh, we've got the Joint Agile Planning Sprint with Rotary of Beaufort, and that's going to be on the 9th of July. We also have the uh, tree planting with Trillion Trees on the 16th of July in Guildford. And we also have the midweek networking drinks at HQ Bar on the 20th of July. So quite a variety of things to get your hands on and get involved. Rotary International President Jennifer Jones has said to us our theme for this year is Imagine Rotary. Imagine a Rotary that is adaptable and it resonates with the members in flexible ways. This year we have specialized the squads. Within our club we have five squads that are focused around an area of interest or a frequency that those members resonate at. At the moment we've got the associate squad, the chill community squad, the high energy social squad, all about making friends, not just doing volunteering, but also other fun things. We also have the professional development squad and the personal development squad, which some people say has a bit of overlap. True, but I think they're distinct enough to have their own squads. At the Agile Planning meeting on the 9th of July, we'll be discussing club culture. And that is going to show up in three different levels. One on an individual level, how will our members interpret the culture that we co-designed together on the day of the Agile Planning Sprint. Two, how will it show up within their squads? And three, how do they want it to show up in the club as a whole. When it comes to culture of any kind of organization or group of people, it really needs to be designed in a collaborative and cooperative manner. So I'm looking forward to that activity at the Agile Planning Sprint. Another piece of club news is that our squads will be grouped into clusters headed by our cluster hosts, being directors, Nick Lim, myself, and Joshua Morley. The first squad dates will be decided at the Agile Planning Day. So if you want to be in the know and pick a date that's convenient for you, do make sure you come along to that. And then you'll be able to decide what activity and what date we're going to be catching up as the different squads. Also at the Agile Planning Sprint, we will be designing projects in an agile manner for our members to execute and deliver for the community. If you want to get involved in a project team or you just want to help imagine what kinds of projects that our club can deliver for the community, please do register and we'll see you there on, the sat on Saturday the 9th of July. For the past week and for the week leading up to the Agile Planning Sprint, I have been calling and will be calling every single member in the club to talk about what you want to get out of Rotary, what you're able to give to Rotary, and what frequency you're going to resonate in within our club. And also to find out what squad you're going to pick. So if you haven't already, please reach out to me for that chat. Otherwise, if you're not able to have the chat, it takes about 30 minutes, it's about eight questions. I can email it to you instead, but I would much rather have a conversation. I'm looking forward to working with all of the members within the Rotary of Elizabeth Key to bring forward a, and imagine a really successful year for our club and for Rotary. Thank you. I'll see you next month on another one of these videos. Now I need to find a place for the celery. Uh, there's no good spots like 
If I could find some other celeries within here, then I could plant it with its friends. 